Yo, what's good everybody on YouTube? Thank you guys for tuning in back for another video on this channel. And in this video, we'll be going over the New Balance 1906R in the Refined Future Pack. Unfortunately, your boy does regret his sneaker purchase when it comes down to the colorway he purchased, but we will be styling the black colorway in three different outfits today. We also will be showing the pair with the nice, what would you say, grayish cream? I don't even know. Um, but this is Brandon's pair. This is a size eight, so unfortunately I won't be tossing it on feet. Maybe I'll film him with them on feet. But we have two shoes from the pack of four here. We're gonna go over the two that we do have and then also just give you guys my overall ranking when it comes down to the four and then also just style them at the end of the video. Let's go ahead, hop into the vid, smash the like button, subscribe. Let's get into it. All right, you guys, so like I said, out of the four, we do have two pairs of the four pack. Um, these are called the Refined Future. Also, people are just calling them the Protection Pack. Obviously, you guys can tell the similarities when it comes down to the New Balance 2002R. Um, they did release in a pack of four. I did post them on Instagram. Shout out to everyone who did cop from that link. Honestly, y'all went crazy. Um, they randomly drop on New Balance's website at like midnight um, on New Year's. But yeah, we have two out of the four. If I were to rank the four, I'm gonna go ahead and say that the gray pair goes first. Low key, these probably go second. And then I'll put the, I'll put these third and then uh, the one with the black sole, I'll put in fourth as well. So we'll put it up on the screen with the rankings and everything. But honestly, I do regret my colorway purchase. I've been seeing the gray pair a ton and I feel like I low key regret that because um, I thought I needed a black shoe in my collection, but the gray pair just goes off. Honestly, I've been seeing them on feet, seeing them on Instagram and they just look really, really cool. Overall, I feel like the black pair is something I did need in my collection. I'm just not used to wearing black colorway sneakers. And then seeing this one in hand um, with Brandon's pair, this is a good summer shoe as well. I love the gold hits or the silver hits as well with the navy blue on the back tab. But yeah, so going over the sneaker, obviously you guys can see it does have the same midsole as the 2002R. They just kind of changed up the top portion of the shoe. Um, these are called the 1906R. I feel like there's a lot of great alternatives when it comes down to this shoe right here. Overall, this model is similar to the 2002R, so I feel like this one will be a banger when it comes down to new balances. If you guys are on the fence of purchasing these or the 2002R, honestly, I would just say go with the originals because I feel like those ones are just uh, like, I feel like that pair really blows these ones out of the water. The 1906R is a very fire colorway. You do have these same like suede panelings, different toe box. They did cover it up a little bit comparing it to the 2002R. But as far as sizing goes, I would say go true to size in these. In the 2002R, people did size up. I can see why they would do that, but I did go with a nine and a half in the 2002R and the 1906R. Um, the 2002R is a little snug. So I would say true to size in the 1906 I feel like I'm just tossing out a whole bunch of numbers. Go true to size in these if you guys are on the fence as far as sizing goes. As far as resale prices, I feel like these aren't too high. I feel like no one's really reselling shoes nowadays, so definitely worth the cop. Let's go ahead, hop into the outfits. Hopefully you guys do enjoy the styling portion of this video. Quick cameo, I'm gonna have Ari rank this photo. Um, I did try them on earlier and she told me I messed up by getting this colorway right here, but I kind of wanted to switch it up because it's too close to the 2002R that I already have. Um, but what would, what would you say? Like one to four. Okay, gray ones. But yeah, like you said, it's the same as the 2002 R's. So okay. if you have those, you don't need the gray ones. I kind of like the cream ones with the black sole. See, this picture, I feel like I'm going to choose the black ones, but in person, I'd choose these. So this is third? Yeah. And then the pair that I have is last? Sorry. Okay. Black midsole ones, low key a sleeper, but yeah. What if you put white laces or like yeah. cream laces? Maybe I'll put cream laces. Maybe I'll put cream laces in these. Maybe they'll switch it up. Uh, we'll see. Follow me on Instagram if you want to see them with cream laces. I'm back. Hey, yo. I like that. I'm just back in the videos. No, like that. <laughs> w Riz in the comment box. <laughs> All right, not gonna lie to you guys, I thought I needed a black shoe in my collection. Apparently I don't. It's kind of hard to style these. Uh, for me personally, I just really am not a black shoe type of guy. I feel like in order to save this shoe though, if I do toss on some maybe like some cream laces on it. So we do have one outfit on right now. We're kind of struggling to find the other two. So for the first outfit, I do have on a Flake Studios blank crew neck, dropping very, very soon, February. And then we do have on the Amazon Carhartt pants. I'll link these down below if you guys are interested in them. Um, they do drape over sneakers very, very nicely. So I'd highly recommend them. They're only $50. And then on feet, we do have on New Balance 1906R. 
black colorway, low key regretting these, low key should have just copped the gray pair. But hey, we'll move on, keep it pushing, and hopefully you guys do enjoy the on-foot clips. All right guys, I was low key doubting this sneaker, but now I'm not. We found some fits. Obviously it's another crew neck fit, but I really love crew necks. So you could probably toss on a gray hoodie with this too. But on top, have a vintage Russell Athletic crew neck. Um, white t-shirt underneath, this one's from Target. Have some dicky pants from Tilly's. I feel like all this is like really cheap. These pants are only like $45, so I'll link them down below if you guys are interested in them. Just a nice pair of brown dicky pants. And then on feet, the black New Balance 1906R. Super, super clean. And then you kind of have the white shock showing if you'd like to do that when you're sitting down. But um, yeah, second fit of the video. Let me know what you guys think about it. All right, third and final outfit. We have a 1213 hoodie on. I've had this for a little while. Shout out to Syndicate and also shout out to Andy. Really been messing with, the, with what they've been putting out on their channel if you guys wanna go check that out. And then on bottom, we do have a Mint Crew uh, courtside sweatpants. These are a size small, but low key should be going a size medium. I'm sure we have some mediums on the way. I really love how the courtside sweatpants have this like flare at the bottom that kind of drape over the sneakers the new balance low-key look very very fire um, with the drape over if you guys can see that in the b-roll clips overall just a cozy type of outfit nothing too crazy about it you know kind of like a grocery store run type fit but i do love the courtside sweats with the new balance uh 1906 i almost said two i almost said 2002 r but they look really fire let me know what you guys think about this one this is the third and final outfit just a very cozy type of vibe while i'm just chilling on this couch right here all right, you guys, so wrapping up the video, hopefully you guys did enjoy it. If you did, smash the like button for me. Go ahead and subscribe if you guys are new here. We are trying to push to 20K subscribers. Drop a comment down below what you guys' favorite outfit was, and then also let me know what colorway of the 1906 are you guys copped. Did I make a mistake with the black colorway? Maybe, but we're gonna go ahead, rock with them, enjoy them, because I do need some black shoes in my rotation. But yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy it. Go ahead and follow me on Instagram and TikTok. We'll put it up on the screen right now. Catch you guys in the next video. Y'all have a good one. Peace. All right, guys. B has on his pair. Bro, how do I see if this is... Oh, there you go. He has the court side sweats on. Looks dope. There you go. B's review. Low-key, guys, I was hating on my pair, but uh, you just got to wear them with uh, non-black pants, and they look fire. I can't film, but yeah, 1906s, fire, black pair, sleeper. All right, I have to go to work now.